The excitement of meeting new people has got to be probably the thing that makes work life interesting is finding new friends and colleagues. So what is it about reaching out to new people that's so scary when we know that's what we want to do anyway? And that might be the, the biggest thing for you at this time is just changing your mind, believing, you know, hey, I'm going to have this hypothesis. Now, up until now, my hypothesis is that, is that no one would reach out to me or be willing to contact me. Now I'm going to change that hypothesis and try something new and then start to collect some data. And one of the aspects of the Stuart system, I, I say all of my trainings are with Stuart system inside, is that focus on data, focus on the data and being a little bit, um, a little bit uh, circumspect, a little bit uh, um, not so quick to believe these other things that we think, like no one would talk to me. Let's not be so quick to believe those negative things. Let's go out and collect some data. So one, having a sequence of messages that you can depend on that work, then we know kind of at, with this percentage of chance at each stage, we expect about this percentage of people to respond in this way. That's going to give you predictability in your job hunt and in your cold messaging. Then the other is just having the belief, changing your belief and believing that you can do it and you can get results. People hire people, not resumes, not GPAs, not legal status. There's no such thing as a, we hire domestic only students or um, things like that. So people hire people, not resumes or GPAs. And so showing up as a person, getting to know people is a fundamental component of being successful in your career. And when it comes down to it, the things that make the job hunt hard or easy um, are not the things that distinguish the job hunts, whether analytics or consulting or banking, but it's what's common to all the job hunts. And that's the communication piece, the communication skills. So learning how to position yourself and develop a focus and then your branding, right? And then your marketing and then how to promote yourself in the market. That's all related to this anchored by this fundamental concept that people hire people. So if you are nervous about reaching out to people, you're shy about it, just remember that this is the fundamental thing. This is the biggest thing that you could do to make progress in your job hunt. And it's not just about your alumni, say, from your own school. It's all people. People have this part of themselves which wants to give. They want to help other people. And especially the more senior that you go, the more at the higher and higher levels of executive success that you go, the more willing they are to help because the more they have seen, they've been in the trenches, they've been in those battles. They know that at the end of the day, their greatest thing that they can do is to serve. And so if you show up and are looking for mentorship or guidance, they're gonna, to a large extent of the time, be willing to help you. And then the question is, can you use that opportunity wisely? Can you really capitalize on that, on that conversation? Can you do your homework? Can you get what you want to get or need to get out of those calls so that they can effectively help you? Because just wanting to help you is not the same thing as helping you in an effective way in the way that you need at this time. I have a couple of trainings that are really well suited towards taking steps towards reaching out to people and connecting with them. One is called My Job Offer Messaging course, which is available down below. And the other is the, the networking course, which introduces networking and the, the logistics and process for setting up a networking meeting. Those two go really well together. And then if you wanted to also add in get interviews now, and then if you wanted to add on to that, you might, my resume course, I have a special program for that which includes monthly live mentoring from me. The opportunity here is not to just develop a series of templates, but to actually execute, execute, excuse me, on them and put your best foot forward, the best resume, the best scripts, the best way to follow up from those networking meetings. Because you'll have live training from me every month, I'll be able to guide you and advise you on a more, um, a more tailored level to your needs with a ton of Q and A.